What's up, guys? Crusader the Designer here from Streamer House, and um, playing some Black Ops 3 beta. And one of the new features is the paint shop tool. You can make your own paint jobs and camels for your own guns. And I've been messing around with this a lot for like past three days. Uh, everybody seems to like it, and uh, I'm just going to show you guys all the things I've created, you know, and how in depth and detail you can go in with these camels. So I'm going to start off from like my least favorite to the uh my favorites um so i got this cuda right here the smg and i got a Searles theme cuda uh Searles is from destiny um as you can see the game doesn't allow you to uh customize the entire gun which really sucks because it would be great to customize the entire gun you know make your own camels from uh, top to bottom um here's a weevil another smg a p90 and I have a Vanguard themed weapon right here, also from Destiny. Uh, another weapon from Destiny, New Monarchy, the uh, New Monarch faction on the uh, Razorback, another SMG. Um, now I'm gonna show you guys my secondaries, uh, my knives. Uh, pro tip to anybody who's playing the beta for Xbox or PC and you wanna make your camels or you guys wanna do something similar to what you see in this video. Um, this side of the knife what you, is what you start off with. You know, you can just make your camo, do whatever you want. This side of the knife is what you start off with. But if you're lazy like me, and uh, take a look at my tiger stripe camo, um, it's a real pain in the ass. It's There's no copy. There's a copy-paste option, but it really doesn't place the... Uh, the layers in the same exact spot on the opposite side of the knife. So if you're lazy like me and don't want to do all of that, all over again what you can do is um just only do your paint job on this side because this side is not visible in game if you want to use this knife in game you will not see it so if i pull out this knife and i load it up in game i'm gonna see this side instead of this side because your player holds the knife the opposite way so that's just a pro tip for everybody uh so i'm gonna show you everything i worked on so this is a fade knife from csgo um, everybody really requested me to do this one, and it's a very popular knife in CSGO, apparently, like, one of those hundreds of dollars of knives, and I did it, it it's really cool, I, I like it, fucking pretty as shit, <laughs> rainbow knife, um, so yeah, then I showed you guys my tiger knife, and once again, you know, do it on the other side if you want it to appear in game, this is my Alley A knife, uh, I made a knife for, um, Alley A, the, uh, YouTuber, Somebody requested that I do this, and I was like, that's actually not a bad idea. It's not the best. It still could use some work, honestly. But, yeah. And one I just put together, a triple rec logo knife uh, for my buddy Ari. Hope you're doing good out there, man. Uh, moving on. So now I'm going to show you. Oh, yeah, I also made a, a Twitch logo on my shotgun. As you can see, once again, there's not a lot of space on the... Uh, the guns there. You don't have a lot of space available to you to customize your gun. Uh, yeah, I'm going to show you guys what I have on my arc. People requested that I do a phase logo. This is not really what I had in mind. I wanted to make the phase logo a little bit bigger, but eh, what can you do? This is, what, this is what turned out. This is one of my favorites right here. The Mirror's Edge themed weapon right here. Uh, I don't even like Mirror's Edge. I hate the game. I think the game sucks, but the fucking logo does look good for a camo on a gun, and I like it, dude. It looks really good in-game. I tried some pixel art with uh, Mega Man right here. It I kind of messed up at the end. It's not great, but it's not not too bad either. So, um... I might end up deleting this one. Uh, this one's another one of my favorites. Uh, Deadpool. Uh, people requested me do this last night, and I did it, and it turned out great, and it even looks so fucking awesome in-game. It looks amazing in-game, and I love it. And uh, another one from Destiny, uh, the Iron Banner logo. Uh, Iron Banner theme. This one was uh, pretty annoying to make. I had to make this twice because my fucking game bugged out, and it wouldn't let me save it, so that was really annoying, but yeah, it looks pretty sweet. I actually did it better than the first time, so... <laughs> now for the best part the m8a7 is the only gun in the game that lets you 
record uh not record what am i saying uh lets you customize a majority of the gun and this is pretty much most of the work i did oh let me just delete this one i did a triple rec one on this gun too but i didn't like it i really don't like it on this one so eh, i'm actually gonna delete it i'm gonna delete it rip all right now got another Searles themed weapon on the m8a7 i got a dead orbit themed M8A7, uh, Vulcan from CSGO. Vulcan is a skin from Counter-Strike. Aqua, this is a skin from Black Ops 2. And it actually turned out pretty amazing. I didn't think it would come out this good. I might end up deleting this one, Cyrax, M8A7. It's also from CSGO. I don't like this one too much. People request that I do this one, but eh, I don't know. I do like the Asimov though. This is also from CSGO. This one was requested too. Um, this one looks really good in game. This is one of my favorites. I also made a uh, Nvidia Claw logo. Uh, if you can see right there by the handle of the gun, it's the uh, Nvidia Claw, and it looks it looks cool. But overall, the gun doesn't have really much flash to it, so I might end up deleting it, or I could work on it and make it look better and just get rid of that Nvidia. I don't know. We'll see what happens. This is Volcano, a uh, gun from uh, Borderlands Two. A sniper rifle and this is another one of my favorites the trials of osiris themed weapon right here the trials of osiris eye the osiris eye or whatever i love this one this all this one also looks really good in game um now another black ops 2 camo i made in black ops 3 party rock um this one is just hands down like <laughs> i don't know it's like look at it it looks so fucking good dude so fucking good and i love using it in game it looks awesome in game uh this one is also from csgo it's called gecko a csgo skin uh highly requested optic gaming camo that everybody wanted me to make don't know why but i did it and it turned out really amazing i love it and yeah everybody wanted me to make optic gaming and i did so that looks it looks sick it looks good to use in game as well uh, Red Tiger from Modern Warfare 2. This one's really not that special. It looks, uh, it's whatever. I can make this in, again in like another five, three minutes maybe. And this is Point Disarray, another CSGO skin. This one was pretty cool to make. It was pretty fun to make. I like it. I like it. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much all the camels I've made during the beta, and I'm only going to be making more. So. I want to hear the request from you guys because I'll be playing the PC beta as well. So come hang out on uh, Streamer House. Give me some requests for uh, skins or anything you guys want to see because I'm just having so much fun and you guys are apparently loving it. And I just want to, you know, just make more skins. <laughs> so my name is Crusader. Have a good night, guys. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.